Hello, I'm uh, Michael Boutrio, uh, as you know as uh, Comic, and I'm the designer of the Beldam Bay Rates. It's a board game that is going to come in tomorrow in uh, board game shops. Uh, it's a game uh, that I have developed uh, four, uh, five years ago. And the principle is to visit the Belgium and its breweries. And we have uh, 40 breweries that uh, are on the game that are real breweries. And you have to visit the maximum of breweries, uh, drink a maximum of beer and buy a maximum of beer. But more you drink, more it's difficult to move. And more you buy beer, less you have space in your backpack. Uh, it's something that uh, can be done in the real life because everything is real. You have three uh, ways of moving from breweries to breweries. You can go by bike, it is slow. You can go by uh, public transport, but sometimes in Belgium it's not very working very well. And you uh, maybe can have a delay. And you can uh, each hike, but each hike it's not uh, always very good because you, uh, you can have Sometimes you can be taken or not. And every decision is important because you have uh, a, uh, an amount of unit of time for uh, go through the Belgians. And there is a lot of way to, to, uh, to, to do the games and to win points. And at the end, who have the maximum of points have won the games. Um, it's something for the, the board games players. It's a real game but also for beer lovers, because my two patients are beers and board games. And it's a crossover, because it's a crossover because I love both and I want to do something real that can um, promote the beer in Belgium, because we have a wonderful lands, uh, countries about beer. And it's why the games come with a beer books that explain the 40 breweries and uh, little stories and give information. It's very important. And in the middle center of the uh, middle page of the, the booklet, you have a passport you and go check the breweries and can visit them and have a stamp. And it's very important because uh, it's a real game about beer and for beer lovers and for board games lovers. So there's a learning thing too. It's helping educate the public about the wonderful diversity of beer hair. Yes, it's, it's very important to, to give the information and we have a, a large uh, panel of breweries in Belgium that is small breweries, but big breweries, old breweries, uh, young breweries and it's the, the Belgian market, it's like that. We have a lot of different things. It's important to, to give information about everyone, but all the worries in the game are independence. It's not from a commercial group. It's something very important for, for, for us to have real brewers that don't do beer à façon. I don't know the industrial word. Industrial beer? Yes. Yeah. No industrial brewers. Everything is from uh, love of beer. And it's important for us. We, we, we communicate with every breweries and want to do something that reflect the, the give the, the the overview of the real craft beer market in Belgium. What made you do this game? What was the drive? <laughs> um, I, as you know, I'm a, a, a lover, a beer lover, and um, each year I I go to the Brussels Beer uh, Marathon. I, I run Brussels Beer Marathon. Yeah. Yeah, here in Brussels. Oh, yeah. Oh, here. And there is one from Brussels from years ago and uh, five years ago. I did, ah, it's a good idea. You can do the same, go from bar to bar and drink beer. You can do a board game like that. And it was in the middle of the night and I was so drunk. And the morning, morning after, and I said, oh, let me see. Uh, I remember that. And why not? And I tried to do something. And two months later, there was the first prototype. And it was uh, uh, just a, a, a map of Belgium, uh, a road map with stickers and uh, stand. And, and we start like that. And now, five years later, we do last year a Kickstarter that we can uh, uh, produce the game. And now the, the game is coming really to, 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 to shops. And it's, it's crazy because it's come all the, in the French speaking part 
of the world, but also in the United States in the same time. And we are negotiating for other countries and there is a lot of interest because the beer is for everyone. Uh, and it's very interesting because when we start that, everybody say, oh, a game about beer, it's not, it's not a good idea. It's not, it's not going to work. And we say, yeah, I think we can do something. And now we are a uh, few years later and we can say that, yes, it's going to, going, to, going to, ch to shops and going to be available. And there is a lot of interest. There is a community um, between. Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't know the word for that. There is a community uh, around the games, and it's very, it's very cool because we uh, we we do the good choice to do that. You foresee doing, say, the American beer, you know, the, uh, adapting it for different countries in the future. Okay, but it's it's a good question because we are currently working for. Uh, uh, USA version, but a small part of the USA, and we are working on a French version, but also on other maps with other Belgian breweries. We have uh, several contacts. We some someone have uh, asked us for do the same for the Scottish whiskey, and why not? We uh, we go, we are for the games. We we start a company which is Beer Games. And it is black, yellow, red games. And now the, the future is open. We are going to keep on working, but we want to do things like we want to do it. That is, uh, we, we, were, we are looking for ecological footprints and we want to do things that are uh, human based. And the more important is develop projects that we are going with our philosophy. And we are going to see, but the, the next game is uh, a game about Belgian beers in, with dice. It's a smaller game. And we have several projects that are coming, but one step after one. Yeah. And you might even do one with bars. There's so many amazing traditional bars, I guess. <laughs> hey. And what's your favorite beer? My favorite beer is for long time it's Orval because oh, right. for Belgian beer but my favorite style is stout. I, I drink every kind of stout. It's my favorite one. There is a lot of taste and it's why I, I love beer. It's in the same style of beer you can have different things and it's always interesting. You can discover beer every day if you want. And uh, much thanks for joining in and uh, doing this during Belgian Beer Week. That was, thank you thank very much, you very much. <laughs> and drink some beer.